that uh, there was like a a special, I don't know, a special like queen bug or something. That'd be kind of cool. All right, everyone, welcome. So we have these resources here. Robin is building us a silo right now, so we can't go get a fish pond, but I put them there so I would remember, it's gonna rain, that I would remember to go and do it. Because you know how it is. Uh, sometimes I don't remember things. Salmon return their spawning ground to lay the eggs. The rivers are full of them. You can only find them in the fall. Okay. So what we're going to do with our good friends, the resources. Okay, we're going to put them in here so that I remember that we need them. Look at that. Uh, yep. Organize. Now then, let's do some more copper bars. We will need those. And we're going to... Uh, Chop down some trees today, I think. That's the plan. Now, there are other things that I would also love to do, but I think chopping down trees is the most important right now. We'll see how, how long into the day we go with that. Hello, hello. Now, we did just uh, milk the goats yesterday, so I don't believe we can do it again today, but let's just check in. Billy the Kid's at half a heart. So is Goatsby. Half a heart is lovely. It's wonderful. Hello, all of you beautiful and amazing chickens and ducks. Great to see you. Uh, you know, it is kind of fun to walk into the coop or the barn. And just, like, have things waiting for you. Like, items that are ready and... Items that you can make into more mayonnaise and stuff, and that's a pretty nice feeling. I'm not sure why it is that... Oh, they're not full yet. Okay, never mind. I was going to say, <laughs> why are we still not... Why are we still getting milk from them that's not maximum size? But I suppose it makes sense. Oh, here we go. We are going to need some more seeds for these. Maybe we stop at Pierre's and uh, do a little purchasing, huh? And our grapes are finally growing. That is nice to see. You may be wondering, uh, what are you going to do with those grapes? Well, first of all, we're going to save some. And eventually we'll get the dehydrator and we'll make... We'll make some raisins. Because at some point, I would like to have some Junimo huts on this farm. That is one of my goals, is to sort of structure an area or two where we can have some of those. And um, I can enjoy that. I, I, It's not something I usually put on my farm because they're not very efficient. But I heard that if you put some raisins in there, they might... They, it, they can get double harvests of things, and that's pretty amazing. So that's what we're going to do. That's the plan. That's the plan. Now, where do we chop down the trees at becomes the question. And my answer is, I think we're going to do it over here. We're going we're gonna to do these trees. Now, with that being said, okay, I'm, I'm having a thought. And I think it's a good thought, and we'll get we'll get to what that thought is in just a minute. First off, we have to just quick stack some resources in the various places around the farm. Right. Uh, what else can we smelt? Uh, we need some more of you. Let's get some gold bars going. Like so. Quick stack there. Now, are we putting grapes here? Yes, grapes are there. Yams are in here. How many yam seeds do we have? We have zero yam seeds left. Well, just some amaranth left. How many days does that take? Seven? Okay, let's, let's grab eight of those. We'll go over to Pierre's. We'll sell some stuff. And we'll be right back. After these messages, we'll be right back 
Raise your hand in the comments if you remember that one. Boy, that that just took me back like like 35 years. <laughs> oh man. Taking me back to my childhood right there. Boy, that's wow. Okay. Okay. We're going to we're going to need some more of those as well. Let's sell all of this. At 20k. All right. Now that, since that's the case, 20 20,000. Do we take a second and put some in the community center now? I think maybe I do because if we if we do the lower values, then we just have the higher ones to do. I mean, we could do the 10k one and just get it out of the way. All right, let's let's do this one. Grab our cake. And we'll do the 5,000 one? Sure. Right. So that leaves us with 10k and 25k. And we already have the 10. So we need the 25. So that, you know, we just did a, a decent chunk. Got half of it done. Hello, artifact spot. I see you. Lost knowledge book. Excellent. Uh, we did aquamarine. I don't think I saved one. Hmm. Maybe I did. I don't think I did, though. We'll look. I'll look. I don't think I did. I think I've sold them. All of them. But let's just take a look. Okay, I don't see any. Right. Let's grab all of these. We're going to put away the fertilizer. And we're going to put... Yeah, we're going to put the cake in there too, I think. Alright, now over here, we can drop those off. Uh, I want to come back over here. And let's just plant these real fast. And then plant these as well. Then we're going to go see Clint. And maybe we can get an aquamarine from one of these geodes? I mean, I know it's not like a guarantee, but that's a lot of geodes. So maybe we do, maybe we do get it. Uh, it would be pretty nice. And maybe we get some items for the museum as well. And whatever we, we get that we've already gotten, we can sell and we'll make a little bit of money from. So let's let's get on this. We're gonna do the mystery boxes first. Hey, a fire warp. That's pretty helpful. Ooh, and some some boomies. We're gonna start with the omni geodes, just on the off chance that they give us something useful. That might be useful. Not sure about that one either. Uh, let's let's move these down to the bottom. All right, Clint, what do you got for us today? Uh, you got aquamarine in here, maybe? Because I'd really appreciate it. Can you get aquamarines from these? I don't even know. Maybe not. Maybe we're wasting time, but that's okay if we are. Because we need to open these anyway. And we're getting some good resources out of it. Okay, maybe not the stone, all right? I was thinking the gold and the iron. <laughs> Earth crystals are nice. More mayonnaise machines. Was oh, that jamborite? Yes, it is. Oh, there's some copper. Yeah, so we've gotten enough to make a bar of every kind of uh, resource except for iridium, so uh, no complaints there. Oh, yeah, petrified uh, slime. Okay. Oh, there's some more iron. Almost enough for two bars now. Oh, we got another bonus. Uh, what is it? Malachite? Okay. Oh, there we go. There we go. Now we can make two iron bars just from this. Good work. Oh, yeah, there's, there's more stones. All right, we're going to need stones. That's why I'm excited. Oh, there's enough for three iron bars. Clint really liking the green items today. There must have been a, a sale on uh, green item producing geodes. And they all ended up in our inventory. <laughs> the, the mud we already had. Lots of glorious rocks. 
some more coal, which is good, because we needed that. Right, now, what do we not have? Gunther can tell us more. Gunther can tell us more. We can sell that. Gunther can tell us more. We can sell it. Gunther can tell us more. We can sell these. Okay, we can sell this. Gunther can tell us more. Alright, so the bottom row is all Gunther can tell us more. Everything else we'll either save as resources to take back to the farm, or we'll just sell back to Clint here in a second. Okay, we have, we have that down there. We have that down there. We've gotten this already. Okay. Here we go. Top row selling. Uh, so we almost made back the entire cost of the opening of those geodes. Pretty solid. And we got several items to donate, which is even better. Yes, I would like to donate. Here we go. We got a couple green items. We'll put those here. Lovely. We got some blue items. Yeah, this should have put... I should have put the purple ones over slightly to more to the right. Because now that's gonna look that's gonna look off if I put if I put that there. Uh that's a real shame. Well, one of these days. One of these days. Okay, and I need the blue. The blue dwarf scroll is what I need. Just give me one second. Where do we find that scroll? The blue one is found. Several monsters drop it. 1.5% from blue slimes. Okay, so we just have to fight enough blue slimes. Lava bats drop it. Lava crabs, squids, it's, uh, shadow brutes, shadow shamans, metalheads. Okay, so we just have to go and uh, mess around in the iron floors some more. Okay. Well, now that we know that for sure, that's good. Let's move. Take our loot back to the house. What a weird spot for a forage to be. What do we have? It is Thursday. Ocean fish. Bug guts. A hundred pieces. You know what? I think we can do that. Let me uh, get back to the to the house, and we'll we do it to chop down some trees. But a hundred pieces of bug guts really shouldn't be that hard. Like, like not at all, honestly. Um, you just have to go in the early floors of the of the mines, and uh, there you go. That bush on the far right is just it's taunting me. I see you, Bush. I see you. Goat, could you not be in the middle of my crops, please? <laughs> what are you doing there? Oh my goodness. What is that about? And where are we putting our warp totems? I guess in here? Okay, great. Now then, uh, where's that broccoli? I gotta eat a broccoli. We're low on energy. Oh, hello. The beat was done. The beat was done. What can we plant in place of the beat? Uh, I guess you? Okay. Now, we're just gonna take out this row. This top row, I think. Well, every five trees is like a hundred wood, roughly, right? I think there's this six, it's like a six in a row, so there's 120 wood per row, basically. All right. There we go. And then this one. Okay, so that's 130 wood. Which puts me at 270. Uh, that's a decent amount. 
Do I need this for something? No? Well, I mean, yes, later on we do, but right now, no, we don't. Okay, that's, I mean, that's fair. Put away the fishing rod. Grab another broccoli. And uh, go to the bus stop. Okay. Well, that's what we're going to do. And on the way there, we're going to stop and grab this this bush. Oh, delicious. Thank you so much for the blackberries. Mmm, so tasty. Oh, yes. Even tastier. To the left. To the mine car. To the mines. Now, if we go to, like, floor 10, we just have to look for bugs, right? So, I mean, okay. Technically, this would be helpful, but it's not actually helpful because there's no bugs. It's just slimes. How dare you, game? Well, we got the red one. That's not the one we need, though. What we need is the blue one. And there's no bug meat later into the mine, uh, like where we could get that. All right, there we go. We have found one. <laughs> this might be more challenging than I had anticipated. Just saying. There's a couple of bugs on this floor. Bonus yam. I will take that with great joy. And I suppose we'll just come out here. Oh, there we go. So we'll just come out here. We'll get some copper and break some of these gray stones. There's what we're talking about. All right, we got five. It's not a lot, though, really. I mean, we need a hundred, so five is like a... It's a good beginning, you know? It's a good It's a good start. Because not every bug drops it either. Okay. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this poor bug on the right side there. Just no room to fly. Like really, we did it a favor there, you know. We put it out of its out of its misery. A second monster floor again with no bugs, just slimes. Game, please. This would be so amazing if it was filled with bugs, or if bugs were flying in from the side right now, going. Bzzz. I would be very excited. I would I would be ecstatic actually. Not a word I use often, but I would be very happy. A lot of slime today, too, as a result of the monster floors. Okay, bugs, where you at? How you doing? There's some grubs. Okay. Oh, yeah, there's some more. Give me... Oh, look at all of them. Yes, give me your meat. Lovely. Thirteen, you say. Well, well, says I. Anybody up here that's a bug friend? No, just a slime friend. Oh, nope, there's one. Oh, and it was worthwhile, too, because from that one, we got some meat. There's a couple there as well. Yeah, I'd say it's going pretty good. Uh, we've got 16. So if we can make it to like 25, I'd be excited. It's a rock crab over there. <laughs> you just swing your sword. Kathunk. Yep, well, we know what that was, boys. <laughs> oh, bad. Do we even want to mess with floor 19? I mean, I don't really feel like I do. 
It's late in the day. If I could just teleport over there, I would... I would be excited about it, but... Oh, man. There's... There's just... Yeah, this floor is... It's just so large that... I don't think it's worth the time. This, however, seems very nice. Oh, staircase as well already. Oh no. There was no there was no bug meat there. How much copper have we gotten? 32. Okay. That's a I mean, it's like a nice side bonus, really. Floor 17, I think, was that? Was it? That was so good? That was a good floor. And a crate. Nope. And a bug. Yep. Okay. Oh, grubs. Ooh, more grubs. Yes, more grubs. Okay. Now we just need a staircase. Break all of these stones. I missed twice. Oh, there's some. Okay. Good, 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 good. That's what we like to see. Got a couple out of it. It's getting late. What are we at? 24? I'm really close to my goal here. I said 25 would be lovely. And there we are. <laughs> There's 25. <laughs> All right, well, we got 25. Uh, I guess I can't complain. I said I'd like to get to 25, and that is exactly what we made it to. <laughs> All right, then. All of our stuff is done over there. My goodness. No aquamarines still, though. Let's grab those two back out. Come over here, drop that off. Go back over here, drop this off. I don't have a regular yam in there? Oh yeah, I do. I thought I did. We only got one seed back, huh? Bummer. Okay, so we need some more pale ale. Uh, let's do pepper jelly. Okay. And then I want one... One cranberry. One regular cranberry. Okay. 41. Oh, I can just check it without selling it. Yeah, look at that. 41 to 140. I mean, that's a pretty good increase. Yes, indeed. That is a very solid increase. We would need a lot of preserve jars to make that happen, though. A lot of them. Now, that's not all the money we made today. But we did sell some stuff straight to Pierre as well. Yes, we did. All right, and now it is raining. The cat is sleeping. The weather tomorrow is cloudy. The fortune teller today is good humor. And boy, if I could make monster musk, I would be in business today. Yes, I would. It would be great. Grab some eggplants while we're out here. Go and say hi to all of our friends. Hello, everybody. Hello. Why are you angry? Not get, uh... Not get enough food, huh? There you go. No milk. Are you going to be a day off now? 
probably are. Well, that'll actually even out my income a little bit, so that's... That's really not that terrible of a thing. Boop. 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 And a boop. And corn. That's a, grapes are not ready. All right. Get the corn. What else is down here? Nothing that's ready. Okay. Now, do we chop down another row of trees? I could use more wood, probably. But I really just kind of want to get into the mine and search around for bug meat. Um, that is pretty important to me at the moment. Okay. Just sell some of this stuff that we don't need. Let's just uh, take a real fast peek and just double check what we're missing. One large goat milk or a wool. Don't have those. Uh, winter forage, not worried about. Sandfish would be lovely. Money and money. A jack-o'-lantern, not a problem. A truffle, a poppy, and one apple. You know, that apple tree has got to be pretty, getting pretty close here. Yeah. Should be not too much further into the fall that that tree is done growing and producing some apples for us. Now, is Robin done building the silo? I think so. And if so, we'll go run up and we'll see if she'll start a fish pond for us. But before we do that, let's check the cart for some of the things that we still kind of need. I don't need any of this stuff. Okay, you have nothing that I want right now. But maybe in the future you will. So let's go run up here. We're going to check the silo and just see how we're doing. And we have to stop and say hi to the chickens and ducks yet as well. How we doing? Okay, it is done. Perfect. So on our way, let's grab the stuff out of here that we're going to need. We need... Oh yeah, I don't think we need any iron or anything, right? We just... I don't think that's changed. At least. Yeah. Lots of mayonnaise being created. We'll go sell it. To the selling point. There. Well, we sold quite a good amount of things today. That should give us a decent amount of income. And now we just got to grind out the income. I could probably go fishing today and speed that along a little bit. Um... I'm not going to, I don't think, because I really want to get the bug meat thing done, but we could maybe do that. We would make a decent amount. Hello there. I believe I already have that artifact. The artifact that I would like to find is a chipped amphora. That would be great. Hey, Robin. Could you make a fish pond for me? You could? Oh, that's lovely. Thank you so much. Where would I like the fish pond? That's a great question, Robin. And I'm thinking that for now, uh, I want to be able to see what's in it. So, uh, I mean, I know this kind of like clutters this area up a little bit and we really need to reorganize the farm somewhat, but like... Somewhere I can see it regularly would be great. So I think for now, we're just going to kind of put it right here. Okay, I'll start working in the morning. Okay, what's that? How much wood, what, how much stone was that? Actually, you know what? While we're here, Robin, 
And I hate to spend money, okay, on this right now, but we're going to buy it. We're going to do it. Now we just need another chunk of change and uh, we will be ready to go for the desert okay bugs here we come you all are slimes you are not bugs at all there's a bug that's what we're looking for and we got from that bug nothing I wonder if we'll have restocked ourselves on stones by the time we're we're back out of the mines today maybe where have all the bugs gone man oh boy another slime floor on the upside um, this is helping towards the uh, slime slayer trophy slash challenge and I have no complaint about that at all I also like that the the floors are green it just makes me chuckle the whole map is green why yes it is that's part of the fun actually there's a quartz oh, there's a bug to the left Any bugs over here no no we're doing a big rock though and just like that, we're already at, four, at a bonus of like 30 rocks here. 30 rock. Was that a show? I feel like it was a show at one point. Three quarts. Okay. Now we're cooking. Cooking with quarts. That's right. Resources, resources, resources everywhere, but not a bug to be found. I'm starting to think the lower luck day was better. Now we're just finding slimes. And these uh, underground friends that we don't need at all for anything. We've already... You've already met your fate. Okay, there's nothing here for us. How about this floor? Willie, I don't know if we're getting your challenge done there, buddy. Um, it's not looking good. It's, uh, it's looking pretty bad, actually. Oh, are you kidding? <laughs> so we could still reach it to destroy it, but we couldn't actually get over there. That's funny. Well, goodness, there's just not a lot going on in the mines today here. How unfortunate for us. Well, I, I have to say, a little life story here, grilling the last couple days has been amazing. As I mentioned in a previous episode, we were having bratwurst, and uh, we did at the hall. That was good. It's been a long time since I grilled, like, more than once in a day, like in a, in, you know, like in a week, and uh, we did back-to-back -back days, and oh boy, that was a smart decision. I stand behind it 100%. My wife was just asking uh, tonight, right before she went up to go to bed, um... She's like, well, what are we going to eat tomorrow night? And I was like, you know, if I didn't have to pay money for it, I would be all down for barbecue, honestly. I, I, you know, some pulled pork or some ribs or something. Like, it just, it just sounds amazing. And uh, I haven't had that for a long time either. All right, let's move our bug meat up. We've only gotten three today. That is awful. If we had access to the sewer, this this gets a lot easier. But we don't have access to the sewer, so therefore it is not as easy. Oh, a 
Oh, mystery box and a chewing stick as well. And like, I don't know personally of a good floor to just jump into and like hope that you find bugs, you know? I guess this is probably the best floor, 25. It's not that big and it, it does spawn bugs. So is that what we do? We just go 25 over and over? You get a lot of mixed seeds that way. And a lot of fiber. They have to go out the mine. You don't go back up the elevator. Go out the mine and go back to 25. Right. Well, that was the only one here this time. This would be a lot easier if we had some speed boosting items. Now, there is one grub over here. Lovely. We'll take those stones, get a little bit experience. Yeah. Nothing. There's nothing. There's nothing in this there. This there hill. <laughs> no way, no how. And there ain't no way. And there ain't no how that we're gonna get 25 bug meat. Ugh. We'll be in the mine forever and for always. <laughs> We got a rice shoot. That's not what we were hoping for, but that's what we ended up with. Oh, mix seed. Okay. I'm going to save those, I think, for the island. Maybe that's where we put them next. Ooh, a staircase. I had hopes that that staircase would lead us to, to just like a trove of insects that has never before been found and... Now that would be a cool mine addition, right? If, you know, sometimes you have the monster floor. Imagine if you had like a, I don't know what you would call it, like a, like a bug, like a bug den or something. <laughs> like a, a lair, a nest, you know, whatever. Um, and uh, when you got on the floor, it was just, it was just uh, grubs and flying bugs and all that kind of stuff. And uh, there was like a, a special, I don't know, special like queen bug or something. That'd be kind of cool. You just randomly come across it. Like, it wouldn't be like a set thing, you know? That'd be pretty fun. I would approve. I would approve and appreciate it. Um, I'm not seeing a lot going on on this floor, but I did see this crystal that I wanted. <gasps> and we got a double pickup. Okay. Nice. Out we go, but then back in. But before that, let's eat this broccoli, which will give us a huge boost of energy. Oh, there we go. Look at this. I think 25 might be the answer. You know, <laughs> staircases, please. I know you, you're just trying to be helpful, but my goodness. A lot of staircases. Well, we're at 20 today, so I mean, our goal, our goal is possible. We could get to that 25. Grinding for 25 on 25. Now, just keep in mind, we have to be able to drop these off at Willie's house. So, really, what we needed today was like 50. And uh, yeah, I just, I don't think we're gonna get this one done. We did grab it pretty late in the week. With one more day, I'd be very confident that we could do it. But we're going to need... Yeah, we're just going to need a lot. Maybe if we stop at the saloon. Right? And we buy a bunch of coffee. That would be like the only way I could see it happening. If we could run... If we could just run faster. You could get through it so much, so much more quickly and then... It'd be alright. Uh, I did have a request as well, and maybe I should put this, like, more at the front of a video as opposed to towards the end of a video, but how's this uh, level of perspective working out for you? Do, do you guys want it a little closer? Is this good? Like, what do you think? Good? Bad? Um, 
when the game updated it switched it back to like full percent instead of where it was for the other playthroughs and the other playthroughs was a little bit closer and i had a couple comments on that recently and i said well i'll i'll debate it you know and think about it and uh for me this particular jester shirt okay this particular distance works out really well, especially here in the mines when you're trying to, you know, see where bugs are and stuff. Um, but if it's too far out for most of you to enjoy, you know, like I would think especially if you're trying to watch on your phone, maybe it might be a little small or something or... Uh, anyway, uh, let me know and uh, maybe we can... We can scoot in the zoom a notch. Uh, just uh, think about that one. Give me a little feedback if you wouldn't mind. I'd appreciate it. Because uh, that is something that you, know, you try to balance when you're playing. I try to balance being able to see with all of you also being able to see what's happening. And uh, that is an important balance, I think, to try to find. Oh, a mystery box. Well. Look at all that copper over there. And the bugs. Oh, boy. The greed's going to get us. Oh, yeah. The greed is definitely going to get us here. I need you. Thank you. Oh, okay. So we got 30. All right. So where are we at? 50. We need 45. Boy, talk about a tall order. Like 45 more is still a lot. That's a lot. And I, I mean, I, I think it's possible. I just don't know that it's likely. Does that make sense? Like, certainly it's a thing that could happen. Just don't think it's very likely to happen. Right, we'll put this away. Put that away. Drop off the mystery boxes. We have this. We have that. And we just have to get in the house. Okay, we're in the house. We're good. Who just made it. Just made it. And we made 25. Nice. And we had to sell a lot of stuff to make it to 25. But that's okay. That mayonnaise is really pumping out some good money for us. Pretty soon the cheeses will be as well. Looking forward to that day. It is day 13 of fall. Coming up in the next episode, everybody. Thanks so much for hanging out and chilling with me, your host, Hillhelm. We'll catch you then. Take care.